We're in Blount County. We're about 30 miles north of Birmingham. It's a very scenic county, very beautiful. We have beautiful trees and wildflowers, a lot of wildlife, but we're best known for our covered bridges that we have here in the county. Easley Bridge is the shortest of our covered bridges here in Blount County. It also is the oldest one. It was built in 1927. We have more covered bridges in our county than any other county in Alabama. When I come out to this bridge, and I try to do that every day, it just, uh, it just takes me back just to relax some time back when, well, back when I was a kid. Swan was built in 1933, and I guess we take them for granted here in Blount County because they've always been here, so we don't really, a lot of times, think about how special they are because, you know, we just have always seen them. This is Blount County's longest covered bridge. It's 330 feet long. It spans the Locust Fork of the Warrior River. It connects the Joy community to the Cleveland community. We are at Horton Mill Covered Bridge here in Blount County. It is the most famous of our covered bridges. Uh, it's the one that most all the tourists know about. It's the one that you see all over the internet. Uh, it's the uh, highest one over any U.S. waterway in, um, in, the, in the nation. It's a, um, it's a beautiful bridge with a lot of beautiful rock boulders around. As you approach Horton Mill Bridge, you go, hmm, do I want to drive over that or not? Because it is 70 feet above the uh, water down below. Uh, it spans the Calvert Prong of the Little Warrior River. And uh, it's kind of, a, kind of a scary sight as you're approaching the bridge, but I can promise you it is safe. To, to have these treasures in our county is extremely special to our county, and we really, uh, we really do treasure them. We really are glad that they renovated them and have them back open uh, so people can drive across them. I think it's well worth the drive for people to come to see our bridges. Uh, it takes you back to a simpler time, it gets you off the interstate, gets you off the busy highway, takes you along the beautiful country roads, uh, takes you back to a simpler time that we have seemed to have lost in our, in our society now.